so guys in this video I will be going over how to add a new post and a new page and also make the menu over here a little bit more fancy and more pleasing to the eye so first thing you in order to add a new page as obviously log into your backend admin panel then head on over to posts or pages for now we'll do pages click on add new you can enter the title of your page here testing and then you can select what kind of template you want if you want to be a blog portfolio services sitemap testimonial I'm just gonna do it a default template and that's it you just click publish and then your page is up right now and if you're wondering how I got this sidebar right here I've been messing with the theme a little bit this sidebar was done by going into proficient and then the proficient dashboard then going into layout dashboard styling layout settings and selecting this option this will show a sidebar on so like your blog page and your contact us page but not the home page because your home page is like this you can always edit your home page and set it to a different static home page if you want but for the purposes of this video I feel like this is most most aesthetic to the eye and I feel like this theme very much so that's how I got the sidebar which was you can see right here recent posts comments archives meta and another thing in order to edit the items that show up on your sidebar you want to go ahead and go to appearance and then go to widgets as you can see it's already preloaded with all these and you can just drag and drop whatever else you want or delete stuff which you don't want it's all up to you so that's how you get the sidebar and you can also go into the layout settings and edit it so it goes it's on the left side or you have two sidebars or something like that whatever you want this theme is very versatile and it can design any kind of website that you feel like basically and so that's how you add a page add a post you just go to post click on add new you can do the format and just stick to standard test post test post uh, you can edit your graffiti SEO if you want publish and then view post this is what it looks like and then there's no image yet you gotta set a featured image for your post and whatnot so that's how you add a new post and page and how do you update the layout settings into your theme so you can get the little sidebars that come up on some pages and another thing is that I want to show you guys is the little menu right here and it looks nice as it is but I want to make it a little bit more fancy so what I'm going to do right now is go to testimonials go to testimonial one I'm going to copy this link you'll see why in a minute and then I'm going to go to appearance then menus and then I'm going to add a link URL one I'm going to put link text as testimony one I'm going to add to menu then I'm going to drag this and have it as a sub item to the testimonials so I'm going to do the same thing for testimonial two And then just drag it as a sub item for this and then save menu and then if I go home you'll see there's a drop down automatically testimonial one testimonial two and that's a little weird because I need to drag this back right there we go now save See testimonial one, testimonial two. As you can see, this actually the arrow messed up the formatting again. So I'll see what I can do to fix it right now. So one way you can fix it is delete some pages that you don't need. About us and contact us is basically the same thing. So I'm gonna go ahead and delete one of them, which would be the about us. Remove that. If I save it the about us will be gone so it's just contact us and blog then 
So yeah, testimonial one, if you click on the link. My internet's kind of slow here, but it'll load. It'll go to the testimonial link. I want to go ahead and do the same for the services. It just looks a lot more professional and it's easier to access. I'm going to copy this and then link. This is root canal. Add to menu. And then you can see root canal showed up right here. I'm going to add it as a sub item. And I'm going to do the same for dental implants. to menu and one more services crown and caps caps I'm going to drag that as a sub item to this right here and then I'm going to save and then refresh home. As you can see under services, you have root canal, dental pants, crown and caps, contact us, and then you also have the blog. So that's how you basically make a, the menu a little bit more nicer, more aesthetic, pleasing to the eye, and whatnot. And that's it for this video. Bye-bye.